Hey, BR Tipwell 55 here. And what I got going on behind me is uh, the latest beta release of uh, Ubuntu 9.10. Uh, it's probably not. I'm going to caveat this uh, initial impressions with this is still beta. Uh, final release isn't out for a week or so. I think two weeks maybe and uh, there are still warts on it and if uh, but you know I'm the type of person uh, when it comes to this stuff I'm I'm not afraid to try it out and I'm not afraid to uh, 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 to try to put things through it uh, through its paces uh, I initially had it installed on a virtual machine uh, didn't have uh, any issues on the virtual machine so I went ahead and I installed it on uh, on a real partition now the first thing and this is something that I knew going in but you know it, it's just a lesson learned the in place upgrade uh, although it worked pretty well and it worked better than any other uh, in place upgrade uh, I've ever tried uh, had some problems so uh, so I went ahead and I wiped it and I wanted to resize some partitions anyway give my other operating system some more room so I went ahead and I just did a, I backed up my home folder and I just did a clean install which is the what which oh by the way is how I how I recommend that you you always upgrade operating system just back up what's important do a clean install and then uh, reload your applications that being said it installs fairly quickly it, it's a real snappy install uh, boot up time is really good although I don't know if it's that much an improvement over 9.04 but I, I, I do I, the boot, boot up time does seem snappier now some of the problems I have with this uh, one of the things that I've always liked about Linux in general is really how customizable you can make your environment uh, with some of the internal desi design decisions that the canonical uh, canonical folks have made with this release you've lost some of this that functionality particularly with your uh, with your default uh, uh, with your default login manager you really can't change much about it pretty much your only options are uh, choose an account for an automatic login or you know force people to uh, use a password and that's about it can't change the background can't theme it or at least not easily through the GUI still trying to find what the workaround is to that and I'm sure there's a way to do it but it's just not it's just not readily apparent another problem if you're running an NVIDIA video card like I am the uh, setting up your dual monitors it's going to take some command line work because even if you uh, go in as root and run the NVIDIA display manager it's going to and it's a bug that's on launchpad that it, it's not going to write uh, your uh, xorg.conf file which is what controls uh, which is ultimately the text file that controls your, your display settings what you have to do is you have to back up that file rename it something else run the, the NVIDIA settings manager's root and uh, and then uh, display uh, the xorg file that it generates and then you have to cut and paste that into a new xorg.conf file that was the only way I could get this to work the downside of this is difference from uh, Ubuntu 9.04 uh, even when I had my uh, dual displays working if I wanted to drop into a full terminal session you know control alt f1 was no problem. Now when I control Alt F1 
I get nothing but a whole bunch of weird colors on my uh, left hand screen so there's still uh, there there's uh, there's still some awards to work out on this and I don't know if it's the distro or if it's the new version of Firefox they have on there but Firefox is extremely extremely slow there's no snap or pop to it at all it seems like it takes forever for that thing to load web pages so these are just some of the things that are involved I mean again it's a beta there's still warts on it and uh, you know once it hits final release uh, hopefully most of the stuff will be worked out so that's my take on Ubuntu 9.10 uh, beta and uh, you know reply post video reply great you know do whatever comments are always welcome thanks for watching